Our youth are facing many challenges and they don't always know how to ask for help. The adults around them may care deeply about their well-being but don't always understand what they're going through or know how to give them the support they need. That's why Luchaya Secondary has initiated community dialogues where school representatives and parents come together. Here, they can begin to understand the challenges facing their youth and learn how and where to seek help. Community dialogue, I believe, is uh, the solution for the present problem uh, with the challenges that the young people are facing. The young people will always be young people because there's a lot of uncertainties, a lot of things they are not sure of. Um, to mention but few, uh, some young people find it difficult with their, their studies. You know, others have the orientation that some topics or subjects are more difficult than others, so they come with that anxieties. There are others are having stress with emotional issues. You find out uh, that it could be something not related to studies, you know, they could be find out that some are are being emotionally challenged, they don't feel loved. As my poor Sibena Zonam Sanje, Kubaleki, Loguba Sibena Zo, Goban, Sanga Snake, Sir, isn't an easy name, um, the girl, Guyan, the Uben, like, or Nayo, when I as a parent, and Chicago Kona E, Engel, or isn't Jenges and I'm Sanje. We know your rules, or go to, we suppose to. Parents are already feeling the benefits of the dialogues, which have instilled a sense of hope. Well, the community dialogue is helping us to learn how to talk to our children. So I believe with community dialogue, our learners are going to get help and the learners are going to be fine and be able to concentrate with their studies. As safe spaces are created for school representatives and parents to discuss the challenges facing their youth, they are encouraged and empowered to check how they are, to help them to connect and to show them they care.